Hello everyone, once again welcome back to Pinnacle Engineering and Consultancy. In this video, I am going to show you our State Pro April Intensive Program highlights. This is first day uh, where we conduct introduction to the State Pro and learning grid system. So grid system is very much useful to finalize structural component. Then later uh, discuss about the architectural plan and prepared structural system. And then later import center line plan and then draw a column location as per the uh, auto -head file. Then later uh, defining the dead load and live load as per the Indian standard code provision. And then this is very most important to calculate the deflection of beam where the higher load active and the span is too much big. You can see here this is 3.173 mm deflection. This is the longest beam in this particular structure. So as per the loading and as per the load combination we need to calculate the deflection uh, of the particular uh, beam. Then later on this is very most important consider the dis detailed discussion on ISO 1893 2016 and then this is also important to prepare our load combination as per the IS 1893 2016 uh, to conduct a uh, equivalent static analysis uh, then after uh, designing of the footing uh, by using the RCDC and as per the initial standard load combination in the next day design of column as per the IS 406 and IS 13920 follow ductile detailing that means during the designing of the column we need to follow the ductile detailing rule as per the Indian standard code so here are a few highlights of uh, column designing by using the stat pro and then uh, designing of column by using RCDC software RCDC software is uh, much useful to designing of a particular of all the structural component which follow all the IS code uh, requirement like 13920-2016 this is a detailed discussion of various output report like the this is a column detailing column reinforcement detailing this is a link detailing and this is our uh, column elevation and later detailed discussion on IS 13820-2016 important points like uh, incorrect length, hopper spacing as well as minimum numbers of bar, maximum numbers of bar, minimum dimension of beam columns and so many things. Then later understand high rise building architectural plan. This is actually G plus 9 building architectural plan. Then later import the center line into the state pro and prepare state pro model. Then later assign dead load and live load for this particular one story and replicate uh, above story depending on the similarity of the structure and also discussion about coupling beam which provided in between two shear hole final check for our structural model and uh, finalize our state pro model then later assign flow diaphragm joint weight and design command for design of uh, structural component and then prepare isolated footing using RCDC and uh, also discuss about the pile foundation and the design of pile cap using RCDC and then later uh, designing of column and uh, designing of uh, plinth beam by using RCDC and this is a particular uh, floor uh, at a 3.5 meter first floor level and also discuss about uh, IS 34 1987 detailing of our beam and this is our designing of column designing of uh, beam designing of slab as per the IS 34 1987 uh, IS 34 is basically detailing a code then later designing of the water tank uh, resting on the ground and uh, um, prepare our uh, new project center line and uh, prepare final state model actually this model is prepared by our student Rocky. then later assigning earthquake load to the structural component and provide the uh, combination like this is our state pro model 3d elevation and this is our designing of the staircase we are designing our staircase then the designing of the footing and uh, prepare a drawing for the site execution same for the column designing and uh, finalize layout for site execution then later design of the plinth beam designing of first floor beam level the all the designing done by rcdc and uh, detailing done by autofit this is second floor detailing this is terrace floor beam level and this is terrace cabin level okay uh, in this terrace cabin we also provide water tank so we need to consider water tank load also uh, the water tank load is considered into the live load ok 